the Donald Ross greens uh, on number two are uh, they're not really legitimate greens. They're not greens. They're in a they're in a, uh, a it's you play the the course itself is in our dimension. The greens are in another dimension. Um, I don't care how you look at the greens. I don't care. There's uh, optical illusions uh, that you you know that thing. It's kind of like that thing when you go into the house and there's and the house is kind of t the, those fun house places where it's tilted and the person two people the same size but one stands here and they're taller than the other person who looks like they're three feet tall. Those are those greens. They're they're nothing more than uh, uh, what they are is pain from beginning to end. Thank um, you. And if you and if you get on it, you should get on your hands and knees and and and, and thank whoever it is that you pray to <laughs> that uh, you were able to get on that green. And then if you can get it in the hole, uh, if you can get it in the hole after you get it on the green, and it doesn't go off the green, it's uh, you know there's it, there really is even even uh, even with a caddy, even with someone standing there telling you where to hit it, it's they're intimidating. They're uh, they're you know what. But, Painful doesn't it? Perverted, okay? It's a perversion. It's a perversion of the sport, it, of, of the sport, and the joy of golf. It's just a perversion on it. So, did Donald Ross have a sense of humor? Donald Ross uh, probably had a sense of humor with the, the rest of the course, but that was, uh, you know, the only thing he didn't have on the greens is razor blades to cut your feet. <laughs> well, let it go with that, Lewis Black, back in Pinehurst. Glad to see you here. Oh, it's a pleasure. We hope to see Thanks, you guys. again soon. Oh, I'll be back.